the 2015 special session will be like no other. For the first time since the current Capitol opened in 1905, a special session will not take place in the building. Instead, the special session will be held in the State Office Building in Rooms 5 for the Senate and 10 for the House. This is uh, really quite a thrill, I think, uh, to see that we can actually do our work in another location, uh, a familiar location, of course. Room 10 is normally used as meeting space for House committees. We spend a lot of time here at the, uh, in Room 10 during the during the regular session with our committee work, but this will be a whole different feel. The site is being used instead of the state capitol's house chamber, where regular session is held, and a special session would typically be held because the capitol is undergoing extensive restoration work and is closed to the public. Room 10 has been transformed to mimic the house chamber in advance of the special session for instance, the microphone stands the leaders use in the House chamber are set up in room 10. The speaker's chair from the chamber is making an appearance, and even a replica of the chamber's focal point, the Abraham Lincoln portrait, has been hung behind the speaker's rostrum. It's interesting to be here, and it's interesting for me to be speaker at a time when uh, this, we're having this kind of historic session. Speaker Kurt Doubt and Minority Leader Joyce Pepin stopped by to take inventory of the room. We have an unbelievably good uh, staff that has been wonderful to work with in figuring out all the logistics of how to pull this off, so uh, they've done an absolute wonderful job. Majority Leader Joyce Pepin and Minority Leader Paul Thiessen will be on either side of the horseshoe table. Republican and DFL members will sit in the audience seating, and special space is set aside for some members in the front. This front row has been reserved for bill sponsors. Representatives Garofalo, Erdahl, Loon, and Torkelson are all expected to sit in the front, giving them easy access to the podium where bills will be presented. While much has been done to replicate the House chamber, Speaker Doubt says voting will be one of the most noticeable differences. We don't have an electronic voting system in this room, so we will do uh, voice roll call votes uh, on every vote that we take. So that will take some time in itself uh, to call out the name of each member uh, so that they can vote. So um, uh, it, that'll take a little bit more time. But otherwise, we're going to try to run the session uh, as, as close to the same as possible. Members will be able to rise at their seat. Uh, and we will hand them a wireless uh, handheld microphone if they want to ask a question or speak on a bill. Although special session will be held in a new location, the goal remains the same. Finish the legislative work that needs to be done before the start of the new fiscal year, which begins July 1st. I think all of us are looking forward to the end of this session, and it seems that we're getting closer to an agreement on the outstanding bills. So. Uh, hopefully we'll be in this room soon with everybody and get our work done.